Hey, welcome to Daily Devo. I'm Diana, and today we are talking about humble circumstances. Hey, have you ever heard the phrase, king of the mountain? It often describes this idea that whoever is at the top of the hill, whoever has the highest ground, has the best position, the desired position, the better position, and thus whoever is on the lower ground has the least favorable position, the not great position, the least powerful position. Today's verse is going to talk about this idea. Now remember, the book of James is full of wisdom and reminders of what life with Christ is like as you live it out day in and day out. Today's verse is in the book of James, chapter 1, starting in verse 9, and here's what it says. It says, Believers in humble circumstances ought to take pride in high position. Now, that kind of sounds opposite, doesn't it? Like often we think of those who are rich are in the higher position. Yet today's verse is saying something different. It's saying those with humble circumstances, those with less are actually the ones in a higher position, the better position, you could say. So rather than being lower, it's as if they're at the top of the mountain. Now remember, this verse is one of many verses that together are making a big point in the book of James. And James is about to remind the reader that prosperity, it's fleeting. That wealth is not the best place for us to find our confidence or our security. And you'll see that as you continue reading. So always valuable to check out the context around a verse in the Bible. Take a look at that for yourself today. But back at verses, chapter 1, verse 9, today's verse, James first addresses, he says, believers. Now remember, believers are anyone who has confessed with their mouth that Jesus is Lord and has believed in their hearts like Romans 10, 9 says. That if you declare with your mouth Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. So James is addressing people who have put their faith in Jesus. And those Christ followers who find themselves in humble circumstances are able to take pride or to boast in that position. Why? Well, here's the truth. Because sometimes it is in our moments of humble circumstances that we can see the protection, the provision, and the character of God. It's there that we often realize the beautiful mystery of faith, that Christ is more than enough. One scholar wrote this, maybe it will help. He said, it is not your material resources that take you through the testing of your life. It's your spiritual resources. So with that in mind, what if today, if we ask God to show us how he is with us, even in our humble circumstances, whatever those are, that even there, God is good. Even there, God is with his people. Even there, God is mindful. Even there, God is enough. And even there, God is all powerful. Even there, God is. So today, Lord, we say we'd like more of you. Would you help? We'll see you next time. Thank <laughs> you.